I went ahead and asked all of you to tell me what track you wanted for my next video when it comes to the 2022 DLC. And with almost 100 votes, you guys voted for Bristol Dirt. What are you trying to make me die or something? You trying to put me through a bunch of misery over here? Well, you guys asked for it, so let's give it a shot. All right, so who should we race as here for Bristol Dirt? Gonna be a tough decision. I pick you. Yeah, you. Ah, oh, here we are, Bristol Dirt, Tyler Reddick looking extra spiffy. That actually looks cool, I'm not gonna lie. All right, let's go ahead and skip to the qualifying. I'm just gonna go with a with a standard five setup here, so let's see how this goes. All right, there we go, into that first gear. Let's see what we got. Oh my God, why do I feel like I'm going like so fast here? Okay, this is this is way too fast. This this is whoa, this is way too fast. What the hell? Like the back of the car is like not even kicking out. I don't even know if this is gonna be like a good lap or so. I'm just full throttling it through this point through three and four, and we qualify with a 17-7 dead last. Are you kidding me right now? All right, let's take a look at those little pre-race stories. Chase Briscoe wins the pole at the dirt race. That's not too surprising. Ty Dillon, an injured change after qualifying in the legacy. Yikes, and Austin Dillon, unapproved body modification. Yeah, that sounds about right. All right, let's see how this is here. Green flag. Don't mind if I do. Let me just, let me just, let me just get through a lot of you guys right here. There we go. There we go. Oh, oh, crap. That thing just snapped me right there. All right, I'm going to... Oh, my God. Look at the AI. They're three. They're three wide up here. What? What was the caution? What? What was the caution? They're, did they ride behind me or something? I think they ride behind me. Okay, I'm not gonna pick here though. Alrighty, another restart. Let's get it going here. Don't mind if I do. Just let me go ahead and jump through. A lot of y'all. Why is the AI so slow right there? Now they just bunch up. Oh, man. Oh, my God. I just got stuffed into the wall. What the hell was that? And they're wrecking again. You're kidding me. Do, do, are the AI just going to wreck, like, every single lap? Is, is that really what's going to happen here? Please tell me that's not going to happen. I'm only up to 30. This race already has 15 laps to go. All right, another restart. I think bold strategy here is just to go on the outside and cheat the system and literally just like, just drive through everything here. Get as many spots as possible before they check up. Oh, oh God, it just snapped on me right there. Through the corner. What AI car is gonna wreck here? Oh my God, oh my God, oh my God, oh my God, oh my God. Okay, we, we made it through. We made it through to three. Can we actually make it to four? What is the, what are the AI doing up here? Okay, we actually made a lap. I'm actually shocked at this point. Now they're four wide up there. There goes Chris Buescher, almost spinning out. Oh my God. Woo -hoo -hoo. Okay, the car got really loose right there. Really, really loose right there. My God, y'all voted for this. Y'all voted for this. This is not driving like the track at all. Okay, somehow I'm up to 11. Okay, I'm gonna go to the top. Nope. Nope, Yelly's yeah, blocking. AI is checking up so much right now. Holy crap. Okay, remind me to never do a 100% race at this one because they, they are going nuts up here. Oh, they're almost wrecked right there. I'm gonna say my own words. What the? Razor just knocked me out. What the hell was that? He just flat out just took me out. He just drove into the corner. Dude, the AI are like not programmed. What in the world? Oh my god, Larson's about to wreck. Now Gregson's checking up. Now Gre Greg Biffle's in 10th. Are you, are you kidding me right now? Why is Greg Biffle in 10th? In the car that literally only existed for like two starts. Okay, we're up to 8th now. 6 to go. I don't, I don't know where to go. The AI's checking up like so much. We're going so fast. Like, the cars are not driving the way they're supposed to be driving, it seems like. Like, the back end's not kicking out at all. Oh, my God. The AI just checked up a bunch right there. I'm actually shocked that we're 
We're still green flag here. What? You? Oh my God! What a dirty son of a gun! That might be a wreck. No, no, it's not. Okay. Okay. Larson just shoved LaJoy and I up into the wall. BJ McLeod's up here fighting for a top five. That's completely normal in the 78 machine. Completely normal. Okay, I'm just going to rip the bottom here. For some reason, the AI likes to go all the way up the track and then come back down like apex the corner. I'm going to remind, I'm going to remember that because I, I'm not going to go that way whatsoever. We're four wide at Bristol Dirt. You're, you're kidding me. How, how is the AI not wrecked yet? I don't even know. I'm just sticking to the bottom. I learned my lesson. Larson keeps wrecking cars. Now we're three wide per second. I'm gonna dive it in there. Yep, I just gave Larson a huge bump. Yeah, you know what? You deserve it. You you deserve it. No! No! What? Did it really count that as a crash? Oh my god, it's the real NASCAR tower. Somehow Motorsport Gaze was able to implement the actual NASCAR tower into Heat 5. We are making amazing progress here. Okay, we're just gonna restart here. Now it's NASCAR overtime. I don't know how this is gonna go, but we're starting on the front row at Chase Elliott. And audio, see you later, AI. Okay, well, that was an easy win. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. JK, we're not done yet. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Okay, well, it was an easy win, but definitely not the greatest race in the world. This, it does not drive like the actual track whatsoever um like i really wish the cars actually slowed down a little bit more the rear ends would kick out a little bit like it just feels like i'm driving bristol with grip hacks it almost feels like like i barely have to turn the wheel but out of turn four that's a dub i'll take it that's a dub that's a win on the first try too i'm actually kind of impressed Ooh, a burnout let's see what that's like a Bristol Dirt Burnout. I've never really done one of these before because I'm not skilled with dirt, but here we go. Let's see what it is. Just a bunch of dirt kicking up. Actually, the dirt's actually kicking out a little bit. That's actually that's kind of cool. Just going to keep doing this for, like, another, like, 30 seconds. So how's y'all days? How, how's everyone's day going? Yeah, look at that victory celebration, baby. I love me a little celebratory win. Got the crew celebrating. For some reason, Tyler Reddick still has his helmet on. Don't know why that's the case, but, you know, he, at least he's happy. All right, let's take a look at those results right there. We come home first. Larson, Elliott, and Greg, Greg Biffle in the New York Racing Machine. Fourth at Bristol Dirt. There's 11 through 20 of J.J. Elliott finishes 13th. That's normal. Loris Hesemann, sorry if I pronounced that completely wrong. I probably botched it, finishing 15th. Timmy Hill in 19th. David Reagan in 17th. This is completely normal, completely normal. 21st to 30th there on your board. There's some rough runs for a couple guys right there. Ross Chastain in 30th. And when you go back to the back, Austin Dillon, Kurt Busch, Omnir Logano back there as well. Byron Jones and Bell rounding out the field. Mm, tough break for those guys. Y'all really voted and made me do that? At least give me a warning next time, dude. Yeah, quick review of Bristol Dirt. It, it doesn't drive like the track. The AI just shoot up the track. Don't even go to the outside. Otherwise, you will get pummeled by Noah Gregson or Kyle Larson or anybody in the field whatsoever. The cars don't even rotate out of the rear. I feel like I'm going way too fast on a dirt track uh, for that car to be even going straight. I should be spinning out every single time. And sometimes the car just randomly snaps on me too. But, I mean, at least I won the race, right? Yep, that's pretty much all I got to say. But thank you guys so much for watching the video. Thank you for voting for the track as well. Keep an eye out for the next community poll where I tell you guys where you want me to race next for the next video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Stay sloppy as always. And I'll see you guys next time.